Hello and welcome to another mod review. This time we're looking at the Pottinger Lycotech pack by FBM. So what the guys have done here is taken the in-game Pottinger mountain forage harvester, disassembled it in Blender, took the headers off, and given us a platform where we can hook the full range to. So they've given us a Kemper grass header in this pack as well, which we'll be using on the next five here. You've got the standard in-game 6 meter Kemper header here. So we'll be using that on the Legotech. Had to use these trailers because they're the only ones I could hook to the front of the fence. This one's had to have a front weight on and you'll see why when we hook this lot together. Let's give the grass header a test first. But what they've done to these is looking quite good. So I've got them in the reverse drive position ready. Been getting a little bit confusing hooking everything up. So this one could really do with a front weight as well as you can see. Hopefully, once the trailer starts to fill, we'll be fine. Which won't take long given the field here. So, unfold that. about ready. Sure if we'll seek the trail behind. quite nicely. I know we're not going to get too far with this trailer given the swaths on there. This is like it's up to the usual stand we expect from the forbidden mods team. And the trailer's already full. So that is not a bad mod at all for grass. So let's take a look at the maze one. I'm hoping we've got some maze left to cut. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Remember forwards is backwards and backwards is forwards. No? We'll lift that back the way so it hits the header. As you can see we've got a good bit of weight there. You can see why I actually put the block on. These will not work with the helper, and it's something to do with the game, not with what the guys have done at FBM. I'm reading what they put on the website. I also haven't got a poplar anywhere on here, we can try the other header. Get that unfolded. <coughs> I 
this mine's still up there, but I don't know if it's ready to harvest yet. If it isn't, I'll have to just fast forward it. ready for harvest. Too many attachments on this tractor. I'll make sure we get back onto the right one. harvesters. These reverse drive ones have been around for years. I remember someone local using one back in the early 80s when I was growing up. Seems to work well as well. No issues there. This is completely unfertilised. This maze, so I wasn't expecting that to fill the trail very quick. Fun enough. I how it got maze swirling around in the header, but this is the in-game one. Let's have another forage harvesting game while we can use the tractor. Obviously, we had the potager anyway. This just adds us a bit more versatility to it. So we want to do grass silage, all we actually had was the self propelled, self propelled or forage wagons. Let's take a look in the shop at these. Save that first. So everything's under forage halves to headers. There's the original Mex 5 at 38,000. I've got that header on it. So I'd say the price could do with a tweak there at 38,000 just for that. So 150 horsepower says it'll do maze only but we know it does both now just hasn't been changed in the shop description Pottinger or Lycotec so Pottinger or Lycotec colours as well Kemper or Lycotec New Holland sorry New Holland is the other choice so we know which header this is we knew that anyway we choose our colours. They're basically giving us another grass header in here. So there we go. That's the option. That one's twenty thousand fifty pounds. I've got that configured. So a nice simple little mod this one, but one I'm sure a few of us will find useful. So for now, that's where we're going to leave this video. So I'll say thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you again in the next one. Goodbye for now.